Benny Cunningham, the running back. For Tavon Austin in the end zone. And Jared Goff, your first NFL touchdown. First turnover of the game. Goff. Kenny Britt. Touchdown Rams. He fired it in a hurry. Spotted right at the 15. Benny Cunningham, the receiver back, is in. Goff fires. Catch made. Lance Kendricks. Touchdown Rams. Well, I was getting ready to say points of any kind are good here. Rams with two minutes to go have a field goal, and they've got 96 total yards. And Goff just going to let it fly. He's got Britt wide open, and Kenny Britt makes the catch on his feet, still going, dropped at the one. Third and goal. And here is the quarterback getting in for the touchdown. Jared Goff, and he paid the price a little bit. As he gets the touchdown, not expecting zone read out of Jared Goff as a quarterback. His first touchdown, rushing in his career. Two-yard run. I would like to see that. Get him on the edge, see if he can get a ball to his playmaker, add some space. Paul McRoberts is in the game. End zone throw, touchdown Rams! Catch made, Tyler Higby. Third and six. Play clock's down to two. Goff. Protection holds up. Throws it. End zone. Touchdown. Cooper Cup. It's half full. They can get it going a little bit. Well, Gurley had 19 carries for 40 yards last week. And now Goff rolling as a wide open receiver. And that is Gerald Everett. And the rookie is inside the 20 and run out at the five yard line. They'll spot it in the six, and that's a shot in the arm the Rams needed. Third and two. Rams get out of the huddle and jump the ball quick, and they can't get to Gurley, who scores another touchdown. Two in the opening quarter for Todd Gurley. Can't stop him. And gaining those extra two or three yards, too. From the 39. First down with time, shot downfield. Sammy Watkins tracks it, caught it. Beautiful play. Inside the 20-yard line, the Rams will have it at the 13. And they'll throw it and get the touchdown to Sammy Watkins. Another check down, Beecher. Goff goes quick, perfect in the red zone this year. Yeah. Keeps it that way. Sammy Watkins puts his head down. Watkins to the goal line. Ball comes out after he broke the plane. Ruling on the field is touchdown Watkins. Fake to Austin. Goff fires. Catch made. It's Todd Gurley. And Todd Gurley is in for a Rams touchdown. And a potential game winner. First down pass up the seam and he's caught. That's Higby. <laughs> Beautiful pass by Guff. What happened? He takes it to Malcolm Brown. He takes it inside. Touchdown. You got a third down opportunity. To stop in your red zone. See if the crowd gets into it. Third down and two. Goff looking to throw for the first time. To the end zone for a Rams touchdown. It's the tight end, Tyler Higby. Short pass to Woods. And Robert Woods takes it inside the 30 to 20. On third down at 33, the Rams capitalize a 52 yard catch and run. Woods with the Los Angeles touchdown. Off the plate fake to Gurley on second and six. God fires downfield. It's Sammy Watkins. Touchdown Rams. Has a touchdown today. Goff gets rid of it. And so a touchdown. Second of the game for Robert Woods. Goff just able to get rid of it with Avery Boss 
about to take him down. It's in 60 minutes tonight. Play action from Goff. Goff, deep ball. Robert Woods, he's got it! Robert Woods, he is gone! Touchdown Rams, 94 yards! Well, play action passing has been real good for Jared Goff and the Rams. They're going to fake the draw play to Gurley, and at the bottom of the screen, a nice post route by Robert Woods. And in talking to Matt LaFleur, offensive coordinator, about Woods after he ran that. It was two big Ingram runs for the Saints that set them up for the winning field goal. Here's Goff to the end zone for the touchdown to Watkins. Got a second and goal, right at the seven. All kinds of time. Now guns it. And it's caught for the touchdown by Reynolds, the rookie out of Texas A&M. On fourth and goal, throw to the end zone, catch made, touchdown Rams, Gerald Everett. Unusual looking play down here on second and goal. Goff hesitates. Sammy Watkins. Touchdown Rams. <laughs> Throw by Goff. Pass is caught for the touchdown. Sammy Watkins. It's the same the whole year. And boy, are they showing it today. Goff will throw it the one. Touchdown! It is Woods! Third down and ten. Got past time. We get it out of the backfield. Gurley's gonna walk in! Todd Gurley has his fourth touchdown today. And it's 40 to zip. Goff to throw again. Airing it out for Cooper Cup. One foot, the other one. Yes, says the official, and this will be looked at a bit more closely. Run only five touchdowns allowed on the ground. That's fewest in the NFL. An easy toss. Todd Gurley. Touchdown, and the Rams take the lead. Pressure on Goff. He dumps to Gurley. The blitz was on, and Todd Gurley is roaming through the middle of the field. Wow. Can he go the distance? Todd Gurley, touchdown, Los Angeles Rams. Version on a 10-yard run, over 80 yards rushing. Goff, end zone, Sammy Watkins, touchdown, L.A. Rams. Goff, end zone for Cooper Cup. He has the catch, but he is in for a touchdown. That's the ruling. He, If he held on to that and kept his feet in, that was amazing. Gurley flanking Goff, third and five. And Goff will throw to the end zone, and it's holed in by Cooper Cup. Touchdown. Threw it over Brian Poole, who came back the other way. So the Rams get exactly what they needed. And apparently at this time of night, there's some moisture in the air, and it's slick right now. Goff, deep downfield, and reaching for it, and hauling it in is Robert Woods. At the seven-yard line. Final seconds of the third quarter. Goff, with time. Score it! A lot of other things on first down, and here's Jared Goff, and Jared Goff is going to take a shot right here to Brandon Cooks, and Cooks is there to make the catch. Brandon Cook. Fake the jet sweep, Goff. A strike. Robert Woods. Third and eight, he's looking at a dime package from the Chargers. Goff steps up, feels the rush, unloads downfield. Fighting Cooper Cup breaks away. Touchdown Rams. Goff from the gun. Goff looks. Tosses. Touchdown. Robert Woods. 
Goff, end zone, Gurley, touchdown. Seven yards in that one. Play action to him. Goff floats, cut, downfield. What a throw. Cooper Cup. Goodbye. Touchdown Rams. I don't know how long Zim's going to put up with some of these mistakes by McKenzie Alexander. Cooks might have gotten away with a false start there. They didn't throw the flag. Now in the end zone. Cup. Come on. Touchdown Rams. He's having himself a well of ball game tonight. First down, L.A. going for the whole thing. Cooks. Touchdown, L.A. And when he double clutched this, you see he hitches, hitches twice. I didn't think he was going to have enough arm to get it out here to Brandon Cook. Wholesale movement before the snap. Under a minute and a half to go. Quarter number three. Seam throw, Woods, touchdown. From the 44, first down, and going deep is Jared Goff, and he completes it to Brandon Cooks. Against the Broncos. Early is in, first and ten. Goff, deep. Touchdown, Cooks! Jared Goff, who is a big area kid. Look out, here comes Mitchell. There goes Gurley. We said plays that look the same that are different. They run that stretch play, they run the stretch play, and then off the stretch play comes the throwback screen. You see Sullivan, you see Saffold out in front of that screen. And they hurry up. Empty backfield. And they're going to throw it. And it's a touchdown for Josh Reynolds. Nachdem er die Formation der Defense gesehen hat, Jared Goff. Ja, wieder ein kurzer Pass, aber... Der Touchdown! Und da ist er dann doch! Und das war interessant. Da hat sich Todd Gurley außen hingestellt auf der Receiver-Position als Slot-Receiver. Und dann wartet er ab, lässt die Defense zurückgehen und dann läuft er einfach quer übers Feld. He's been good for so many of these young players that they have back there in the secondary. They play the drive. And a touchdown to Reynolds once again. On Eli Apple there. Rams get the snap away. No challenge. That ball rolled at the end. Here's one for Cooks. The former Saint down inside the 15. Top of the screen. Second and goal. Goff. End zone. Touchdown, Cooks. Quick snap. Goff pulls it back down. Finds a receiver. That's Brown. And Brown goes down the sideline. They mark him out at the five to set up first and goal. And now the other official says touchdown. So there's a difference of opinion. They fake it to Gurley. They throw it to Cup down the sideline. Cooper Cup stays in. Touchdown. Talk about, and they all talk about the simplicity of it as they go to the end zone. And they got a touchdown to Gerald Epp. Start the fourth with play action. Golf throws. Ball caught. Touchdown, Los Angeles. Higby. Seventh play of this opening drive for the Rams. Golf. Plenty of time. Walks it to the end zone. And touchdown, Robert Woods. Second and goal. Part of the end zone. Josh Reynolds. Can find the open guy. Third and goal. Goff. Oh, He's gonna wow. run it straight in. Jared Goff. Play action again with tempo to get up to the line. Cranking it up downfield. He wants Woods, who has to come back and die for it. Regains his footing, and it's gonna be first and goal. Rams. Quick to snap it. Third and goal. Here comes four to the end zone, and it is caught by Everett. Golf on first down. Everett in stride. Wow! Touchdown Rams! Believe me. Off to the end zone. And it is a touchdown for Robert Woods. The first touchdown for either team in a game. Getting out of trouble there and picking up yardage. They're going to go quick here. They're going to give it to Nope, Goss going to keep it and he's going to walk in for a touchdown. Oh. Other than them sitting and resting in game 16 last year. Goff to throw. He is going to go down the field for Woods. He's got it. Robert Woods all the way. Touchdown. Oh. 
bad in the red zone. For a team that has scored as much as they have, they struggle in this area. But not this time. Touchdown to Brandon Cooks. Play action once more. And this time to the end zone. That is a touchdown for Josh Reynolds. Saw him jump up, and all he has to do is throw his man open and knowing that the Josh Three minutes to go, they fake it one way, they come back the other way, and in the back of the end zone, it is a second touchdown reception today for Josh Reynolds. It's going to be eye discipline right here. When you take your eyes off your target, they're going to run away from you every single time. Jared Goff is nice and patient. Harris looks inside. Goff floats. Cooks, what a throw! And Brandon Cook sets up first and goal. Sorte maravilhosa também. O colocamento do Goff faz o passe. Touchdown! Rigby! Touchdown, LA Rams! Toca na partida! Vamos, que, vamos ver aqui, ó, a cobertura de apenas um jogador para cima do Rigby. Não tinha ninguém. Segunda para o touchdown. Goff, touchdown! Touchdown! Los Angeles Rams! Você vê que tá, tem, tem gente bastante confusa aqui. A marcação em zona é. com três recebedores é. e estava lá o Rigby. Livre, manda a bola para mim. É. Don't discount what golf means to this offense. They're down in 16, airing it out. Cooks downfield is there for the catch. Brown, el corredor. Goff, el pase. Uh, completo anotación. Brown, Cooks. Qué clase de jugada acaban de completar aquí entre un mar de brazos. Jared Goff y Brown, el Cooks. Y qué balazo tiró Jared Goff ahí justamente en la trayectoria hacia adentro de Brandon Cooks. Keeps touchdown. Play clock at two. Goff fires and it's caught for a touchdown. Cooper Cup. Running an out route in the end zone, pulls it in, and that's the first touchdown of the game. 75 yards in 10 plays. Goff, pressure coming outside, middle of the field. The catch in the end zone. Touchdown, Gerald Everett for the Rams. Boy, he threaded the needle, and Everett showed good hands and shaking hands with some Ram fans in the end zone. Well, the big part of these last sequence of drives is the penalties that Tampa Bay took. You see right there, right through the hands of Vita Vea up front on the defensive line into a tight window. A lot of confidence in that throw by Jared Goff right there. They're blitzing again. Goff is throwing again. Cooper Cup has a first down. He has a ram touchdown. Twenty nine yards. Just a three man rush. Goff fires it, passes, caught for the touchdown. Cooper Cup. And now, in what it is a two point game. Bobby Wagner, he's deep. He's three or four yards deep into the end zone. And, you know, typically those. That wasn't there. Here's Goff throwing for the corner for Gurley. And waiting for touchdown is the call. Gurley holds on. As he runs his route, he gets a little piece of, of, of Vic Beasley. Now there goes Todd Gurley on the little wheel to the outside. Third and inches. Goff rolling. Looking. Cutting back. Touchdown. <laughs> and the emphatic, yes, I did score before, but I will take it now, Spike. He made the nice move. We have 10 to play in the first half. Goff to throw it again. And he's got his man for a touchdown. Josh Reynolds. And a 
first down at the 35-yard line. Double reverse, or triple reverse. Garrett Goff throw this side, and it's Cooper Cup down the sideline. Cup to the 15, the 10, the 5. Touchdown. Sixty-five yards. The corner for the Bengals ends up slipping and falling. He's in position. I thought there was a missed opportunity of Higby running down the middle of the field. Instead, Goff goes outside to Cup, and you saw Webb on the ground, not able to regain his. Goff, all kinds of time, and going to go deep down the middle of the field, and is caught by Cup. Off with time, deep down the middle of the field, and he's got his man, Josh Reynolds. The Bengals a couple of weeks back, third down and six. Off, deep downfield, he's got a man wide open, and that is Cooper Cup, sooner or later. They're going to spot him out, and then they say he's in. Touchdown. Two officials looked at each other, Cooper Cup. And, and that's that's what what Jared Goff will need as he moves forward. He needs everybody around him to help him out to get to that next level. A couple of number one overall picks for the end zone touchdown. Cooper Cup. Goff delivers to his favorite receiver. And they really need Clowney to pick it up. Second and goal just inside the two. Off the fake, then the pass, and that's caught. Robert Woods for the touchdown. His first touchdown of the season and already his fifth catch of the night. Gurley comes back into the backfield. Oh, fires and that will be caught. Cooper Cup in the end zone. Touchdown. Second and seven. Another fake. Goff on the move. That's been the theme. Being chased by Bosa. Turns and throws. And it's caught for the touchdown. Brandon Cooks. And what a start for the Rams. This was actually well defended. But watch Brandon Cooks at the end of the play. Because San Francisco jumps on Higby in the flat. And Cooks back in the end zone. But what he does instead of going... Higby, seven catches, 80 yards, another big game. Third and six. Goff standing in, delivers. He's got Cup for the touchdown. Cooper Cup wide open, and Goff put it in there for a 22-yard score. The watch Cup as he ends up coming across field. But what great patience as well by Jared Goff to let that develop. Jared Goff. Catch made, end zone, touchdown, Cooper Cup. Let's make sure we know where number 18 is. I mean, he is left completely uncovered as he crosses formation. Gurley splits out, bottom of your screen, Goff to throw, and does touchdown Rams! Tyler Higby! On a first down, Goff, end zone, Robert Woods, touchdown Rams! Well, he eventually got it, no flag this time. Jared Goff, a three touchdown game, and the Rams are up two touchdowns over the Cardinals. Because you know in this league, those guys are grabbing for that ball. Second and goal, play action, Goff to the air, Goff to the end zone for Tyler Higby. And a... He gets caught up in the wash, and he's too late to get to Tyler Higby. And one thing Jared Goff has done really well. <laughs> Goff throwing Higby with the catch, leading for the goal line, touchdown, Tyler Higby. With another inside receiver. Just that much hesitation. Second down after the penalty. Play action. Golf with time. Golf with Higby open in the end zone. Touchdown Rams. Only team to have OTAs. 
Well, the only team to have preseason <laughs> because their timing is perfect and the play calling is outstanding, knowing that you're vulnerable. And Coach Schwartz loved to play man to man. Goff keeps, surges forward, and the signal, not yet. Touchdown Rams, Jared Goff. It's Fake the run. Oh, the pressure is on, but he gets the ball away. It's Robert Woods, and Robert Woods is into the end zone. It's a touchdown. On his hands, gets to the edge, and there's no one there on the Buffalo Bills defense to hold the contain. A.J. Epinesa looked like he was going to get a sack or at least force Goff into On first and ten, a fake. Pressure's picked up, and wide open is Cooper Cup. That's going to be a Ram touchdown. Everything they do ties in. You look at Cooper Cup here. He fakes down like he's going to block. Trey, Trey White, Tredavious White. Cooper Cup right out here, and he's just going to run inside route. There's a bust on the coverage right here on the blitz. Got to be in man. You're playing zone behind it, wide open. Five completions to go to get there. As they motion out Woods. Goff trying to make it nine for nine. He wants a lot here. He wants Woods. He has Woods. And Robert Woods is in. Touchdown. That way, and that allowed Robert Woods to get on top of the coverage. Robert Wood. A lot of challenging misdirection and, and challenging the eyes of the, of the Washington players. This time off to play fake golf. Rolling, is he going to run it? Yes, and he goes in untouched. Touchdown, Jared Goff. Jared Goff now going to drop to throw again over the middle. Caught. Touchdown, Daryl Henderson. With a linebacker, but you would like that. Kevin Pierre-Lewis is a good player, but watch. Just comes up a little choice route, gives the inside. Once he crosses the face, there's nobody in the middle of the field to help. Third down and goal, Malcolm Brown in the backfield. Flare him out. Goff hangs in there, fires, and that will be Woods making the catch for the touchdown. Second down and six. Goff going for it all this time, and reaching for it, and a flag is thrown as the catch made it is by Josh Reynolds. Reynolds able to pull it in. Yeah, the play was just a little bit late getting there, and so this time Reynolds did exactly what we were talking about before, jumped back through the <laughs> defender, got the pass interference anyway, but even better, got the touchdown. You have such an advantage. Anytime the receiver gets behind a defensive back, there should, at the very least, be pass interference on that play because that'll draw a flag every time if you jump back. Three of the four have led to Miami scores. Tenth play of the drive for the Rams. Off the play fake to the end zone. Wide open is Robert Woods for a Rams touchdown. His second of the game. Only down two scores. Robert Woods is going to come up and then over. Cooper Cup is the one that really sets the play up. You see him go underneath, and everyone's eyes now go to Cooper Cup while they forget Robert Woods is right back there for the touchdown. It really should not be able to complete. Play action from Goff. He thrives on the play action. He's got Cup. Cup, Cup takes a seat at the 11 where Quandre digs. Eventually brings him down, but a 31-yard completion. They're going to be competitive. As long as they keep giving him some good players, they're going to be competitive for a long time. Third down here. This one floated for Higby. What a throw. And Tyler Higby catching it in stride. Bucks are only rushing three. Goff back of the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Across the field. And as Jared Goff buys time, he keeps his eyes downfield and then just throws a little touch pass over the linebacker for the touchdown. She's only been targeted once officially. Goff, floating for the end zone, touchdown Rams! That's time. After you made that comment, yeah, I am going to focus on my tight ends. I am going to try to get Higby when we get down into the red zone. They will be a focal point. In Challenge Jared Goff to start the week after last Sunday's defeat. Goff will keep and plow it into the end zone. That's a Rams touchdown from Jerry. Awaiting the extra point. 
That's his third rushing touchdown. What do you need? What's that? Goff takes it, leaps, and he got it. Touchdown, Los Angeles. Goff to his right, throws, passes, caught, touchdown, cut. First trip into the red zone for the Rams today. Third and five at the 15. Pressure's picked up. Goff will throw for the end zone. Low throw. Woods goes down to get it. It's a touchdown. For one of the rare occasions, see that ball a little bit wobbly. Woods beats Austin in a one on one corner out. Up in motion. Goff sets, throwing for his tight end. It's Hippie with the touchdown. With Wolford getting looked at in the locker room, Goff airs it out. Underthrown, but the pass is caught by Cup. Goff keeps, has Woods, oh. touchdown Rams. Acts like he's going to block initially, and so off of that play action, they run one receiver through the other way, and then Woods looks like he's going to initially block in the run game, and he's able to... Goff getting everyone set, looking left, throwing left, it is caught for the touchdown. Van Jefferson, who got all the reps with Cooper Cup hurt in practice this week, comes through with a touchdown, his second of the year. Make the play, if it's high and it's not low and outside, there's an opportunity for a turnover, but he gets it down and away, and Adrian Amos can't make a play on it. Aquí estamos con el partido de los Leones, el pase es completo, touchdown! Touchdown de Detroit. Qué buena jugada. Hawkinson se queda con ese balón en el envío de Garrett Goff. Vamos a observar a, a Goff. Recibe Hawkinson. En cuanto hace el movimiento al corte hacia la banda. Equipo de Houston. Estamos de regreso en el Detroit. Va con la pantalla y a ganar yarda. Solamente un hombre para vencer. Va a ser touchdown. Esta sí no la dejó caer. Ahora sí se hizo la recepción. Pocket's good. Got by some time and throws down the sideline for Quinton Seafish. He's got it. Working on Kevin King for 46 yards. Second and goal. Good protection for Goff. Now throwing, end zone, it is caught for the touchdown. It's Cephas on the receiving end, and the Lions draw first blood. On second and goal. Goff throwing, end zone, it is caught. TJ Hawkinson, brilliant grab for the touchdown, and the Lions go back out in front. Perfectly thrown. And you know they're going to keep getting those switch releases from stack alignment until they have an answer for it, until they know how to play it. And that's smart on Anthony Lynch's yeah. part. Lines up as a receiver at the bottom of your screen. Here's Goff. Guns it! Top touchdown, Detroit! Khalif Raymond, 25 yards. Mission accomplished on that play brings up a third down and nine. Lots some pressure at the bottom of your screen here. Here it comes. They're bringing the heat. They set it up for Swift and Swift with a blocker in front. Looking for the sticks. He's got more than a first down. And DeAndre Swift down the middle of the field. Blockers in front. He's going to take it all the way for the touchdown. Jonah Jackson leading the way and marching him in for six from 63. Protection. Goff gets hit. Pass is caught. Touchdown, Detroit. Josh Reynolds. Right into Goff's face. Goff not really able to get this throw out as much as what he. <laughs> Pass to the end zone, it's there! Touchdown Lions, Hawkinson!
DJ Hawkinson, you're going to see when he comes off the ball and then he pushes it up right there. And when he pushes it up, it allows him then to get that separation. Hendricks out with the bicep injury and Barr dealing with that hamstring. Goff fires, end zone, touchdown, Hawkinson. Just keep an eye right here. It's not a complicated route. He just runs a little quick slant. The Vikings are in zone coverage, goes inside, poor coverage, and that's easy for Reynolds that 39-yard touchdown catch on Thanksgiving Day against the Bears. Goff, first down pass, it is caught. Touchdown. Brock Wright with a marvelous catch. Keep an eye right here. He just lined up on the end of the line of scrimmage, and he's just going to release down the seam. Now, we talked about the injuries to this linebacking core. Struggling. They don't recognize. They don't drop. And then it's an easy pass. There's Hawkinson inside. Here we go. Goff from the gun to the end zone. And he's caught. Touchdown. Watch the cushion here by Dantzler. He did it earlier and gave the cushion. Huge cushion there. Excuse me, that was Woods, I believe. St. Brown with a nice touchdown. And boy, if you're a Lions fan, how good does that feel? That's the way to keep one of the most explosive players off the field is to run the football, and that's what Detroit's doing. Golf passes it this time. Throws it. Caught. Touchdown on the run, St. Brown. 37 yards. You're going to see St. Brown sneak across the line here and just sneak it. In the NFL, they call that an old bad word play. You kind of get lost. You kind of move that zone. Jared Goff winds up. Touchdown, Detroit. Josh Reynolds. 22 yards. Just an easy bang route. A skinny post, lean to the outside, went inside in a perfectly thrown football by Jared Goff. He do a great job. Goff throws. Caught for the touchdown. Who else? Amin Ra, Safe Brown. Hey. Kind of spins out of that short motion. Ball gets tipped a little bit. So Will Holden moves on the left side. On the first down. Oh, another trickery. This time it's back to Goff. Got a man. It's caught by Wright. Racing to the end zone. Diving. Touchdown, Detroit. This is like watching my nine-year-old play Madden. It's just every fun play in the entire playbook from the year. Forget it. We're just going to run them. That was awesome. A little reverse flea flicker. Makes a nice tackle there. Nice stick. Third and short. Goff. Up in the air, it is caught! Touchdown, DJ Chark, and the Lions aren't done yet. Watch the eyes of Goff right here. Hold the middle of the field safety, then boom. He knows he's got one-on-one -on -one versus Slay. There he is, his guys. Watch the eyes. That's where it starts. Hold the safety, hold the safety to the opposite side of the field. Bam, turn, flip your hips, make the throw. Third down and four. Goff steps to his right, throws, end zone, touchdown! Avila, St. Brown. First and goal from the three, St. Brown in motion. Off the fake to Williams, Goff, end zone, touchdown, Josh Reynolds! From the Washington 12, off the play fake. Goff, 
to the end zone. Touchdown. Fake to Jamal Williams. Time for Goff for the end zone. Hawkinson touchdown Lions. There's a flag at the 20. You're going to see Hawkinson lined up here in the slot. You get all those receivers out there, jumbled defensive players get a little bit confused. Jamal Williams running downfield with him, trying to block for him, and he remains the back on second and goal. Fake to him, Goff throws, end zone, flag down, catch made, touchdown, Lions, Josh Reynolds. And that gives you a little bit more flexibility as a play caller as well, knowing that you don't have to necessarily get it all the way into the end zone. Goff for the end zone, it's a touchdown, T.J. Hawkinson. What a game he is having. Third down and five. Goff to Swift, touchdown! Welcome back, DeAndre Swift. And the Lions are rolling here in the first quarter. It's 13-0. The most first quarter passing yards in his Lions tenure. Looking for more here. He's got a man deep. It's Raymond. And he's got it at the five. Gets up and spun down. Another big play for the Lions. 43-yard game. On the fake. Goff looking. That's a man wide. But it's caught for the touchdown. Shane Zilstra. His first career touchdown. Goff going quick. Looking. First read not there. Going end zone. Caught for the touchdown. James Mitchell, the rookie tight end, has his first. Back end line. Great job by Goff going through his complete progression. Chicago is the number one fourth down defense in the NFL this year. Lions looking for fourth and goal conversion off the play fake. Goff throws oh. wide open. Touchdown, Brock Wright. His first touchdown of the year, and the Lions take a 9-3 lead. You're looking at it. Those big guys right there in the middle. It's going to be Williams, the running back. They fake it to Williams. They go up top, and it's a touchdown. St. Brown, the recipient, and his first touchdown since week two. Taking on the almost what we thought would be. But this is a Detroit team with a lot of confidence, looking for the lead. Goff, back at the 10, back at the end zone. And Detroit takes the lead. DJ Shark. The Detroit Lions are for real. Making, you see the quick decisions from both of them. That's the, been the difference for Goff, who's airing it out deep for DJ Chark. He hangs on. Just beyond the 10 yard line now, on second and goal. Goff for the end zone, catch made. That's a touchdown, Abed Ross, St. Brown. Second down and five, off the fake to Jamal Williams. Goff going deep, wide open, touchdown on his first NFL reception. The rookie out of Alabama, Jamison Williams. Not playing today, this is how big it is. Jamison Williams, he runs right by Cameron Bynum. He gets confused. In Vikings territory. Goff going deep. On first oh. down, it is caught and taken in for a touchdown by D.J. Shark. 48 yards. Josh Metellus, number 44, came down. He saw it was three coverage, and D.J. Shark ran. Here I see them giving the ball to Swift. Fake toss to Swift. Goff oh. to the end zone. Touchdown, Reynolds. Two minutes remaining. Goff throws. Wow. 
Panay Sewell, the right tackle, makes the catch and picks up a Lions first Are down. Are you kidding me? Trying to keep this drive alive. Goff. Little pitch to right. Big gain. Brock Wright is going to take it the distance. Touchdown, Lions. The Jets were completely fooled. They put Amon Ross St. Brown in motion, see, to draw eyes. And everyone jumps there because he's the number one threat. Then they sneak Brock Wright, who had the drop earlier in the drive, out the back door, and he ends up in the end zone. Really, really excellently conceived. Currently on this defense of Carolina, Goff, airing it out deep, and he's got Shark. Can he hold on? He does, going to the ground at the 20-yard line. DJ Shark. You can see Garrett Griffin, the tight end, lining up in that fullback position. Yeah, just called up from the practice squad. Time for Goff. Going deep. He's got Raymond. Can he connect? Yes! Kyle Heath Raymond hauls it in at the 20. Goff. End zone throw. Touchdown! He held on! Shane Zilstra, his second touchdown today. They have a pair of touchdowns. First and goal from the nine. Goff throws, caught, and taken in for a touchdown. Second today for Brock oh. Wright. Goff out of the pocket, taking a shot downfield, and free is Raymond. Raymond caught it down inside the one. Hollis Raymond with a huge play, and the Lions are on the doorstep of taking the lead. Third and six, Goff across St. Brown to the end zone. Detroit touchdown. Amin Ross, St. Brown, score one of the season. First down, Goff protected, going end zone, Reynolds, hangs on, touchdown! What an answer, nice job here, Josh Reynolds ends up being the inside receiver after the motion, perfect ball. Gibbs, oh, flea flicker, he's got a man, Goff loading up, Khalif Raymond, he's got it! Touchdown, Detroit! So they start with the short motion on the rookie Witherspoon. He puts his eyes in the backfield when he hands it, and that's all he needed. Once he gets on top, Khalif Raymond. They do have three timeouts left, but obviously time a factor. Here they go quick. Goff, first read, not there. Second read, is there! Touchdown, Reynolds! You lead your team down on a really impressive drive. Nice job there by Reynolds fighting through contact. Dan Skipper signed to the practice squad this week, was with the Colts in preseason, was with De Detroit last year, is in the game. Goff stops, loads, open Laporta! He's got it! And he's got his first NFL touchdown! Well, the route, I love this, right? We talked about the flood route. Watch him at the top of the stem. Bam, he gets Grant, comes back the opposite way on the throwback wide. Goff keeps it this time and rumbles in for the touchdown. His first rushing touchdown as a Detroit Lion. Five yards. Goff. Deep again, wide open, making the grab and taking it in is St. Brown. Amon Ross, St. Brown for 24 yards. So just like that, 35-24, Lambeau leap right into the arms of some Lion fans. Look at the coverage right here by Green Bay. And look what happens, the coverage with Green Bay. A little slip, man-to-man, -man, goes down, an easy re. Goff 
to throw. High end zone is the catch inbounds. It is Josh Reynolds with a Lions touchdown. Jacobs has played well. Emmanuel Mosley got some playing time before being injured. Back to Jared Goff, wide open. He's going to take it into the end zone, and that's a Lions touchdown. A little trickery, but that's two for Sam Laporta today. Goff will keep and squirm, and nothing yet. They're going to call it a touchdown. Just got to make sure. They got him turned. You can see that they've got him kind of turned, but he, he broke the plane to the end zone. Oh, he knew it. Bei dritten und 13. Jared Goff, da kommt der Pass, der reicht, um zu Ramon Ra zu kommen. Schafft er da noch einen First Down? Da kommt ein Vorblocker. Reynolds hat da super geblockt. Ist der in der Endzone? Oder vorher raus? Ja, ich Touchdown! Nein! Ramon Ra St. Brown mit einem Riesenlauf und einem Riesenblock von Reynolds. Unfassbar. Kam und dann geflogen da. Schau dir mal an, guck mal. Hier läuft er nach außen, zeigt er vorne und dann, also wenn deine anderen Receiver so vorblocken, dann hast du richtig gute Freunde im Team und dass das hier noch die Athletik hat, in Bounce zu bleiben. Goff, looking deep, wants it all. Jamison Williams looking for the ball. Got it! Touchdown! This is what Jamison Williams was brought here to do, coming off that top of that bunch. It's the deep threat. And, and Ryan Neal has got to know that. He loses his safety help or his uh, outside help with Carlton Davis. Ben Johnson and how he teaches these receivers to run routes. They put two seconds back on the clock. There he is, the rookie, Laporta. And the Lions have their first touchdown of the night. You're going to see his route and watch Jared Goff when he turns this loose. He starts to throw it and he's not past the linebacker yet. And it's. Third and one. Montgomery is the tailback. They fake it. Great fake. Over the top they go. And it's a touchdown. Brock Wright. Third and one. You got a great running team. And that looks like Dan Campbell running down right there. Of course it does. That was Dan Campbell's number. On third and goal. Just a four-man rush. Goff to the end zone. And St. Brown held up. For the touchdown and the first Lions lead of the day. Amon Ross St. Brown right here on the slot and just watched it. I mean, that is just saying. On the 32. Goff climbs it. Goff launches. Got a man. End zone touchdown. Jamison Williams is becoming a big play threat. And he's got the Lions within a score. Well, watch these two guys right here. These are your guys, and Almond Ross St. Brown, he just creates so much attention. You see right there, Johnson watches him on the ink. Goff over the middle, fires, it's caught for the touchdown at Sam Laporta. Forty-six ticks left. Goff. Over the middle, it is caught for the touchdown. Josh Reynolds, there's a penalty flag. So wait a second. And it looks like it was offside. This is going to count. Ball's on time in rhythm, and he's able to protect the protect the throw by being on time. That momentum just starts to roll on you. Against the Saints defense that was so good early on this season, trying to get back to that. They rush just four on third and six. Goff lets it rip. A touchdown to Laporta. Two drives, two scores, and a marvelous start to this game for Detroit. Just opens up that throwing lane for Jared Goff. Out of an empty set. Goff given all day. Over the middle, Armin Ross St. Brown. What a start for Detroit. We saw early, are they not? 
This looks more like the team that won four in a row by two touchdowns early on. Blitzing the Saints early. Montgomery's become then his first year with the team. They got both running backs out there for this first down play. Goff looking to throw. Wide open Laporta. Blown coverage has Sam Laporta racing inside the 15-yard line. 49 yards. Big play from Goff to Laporta. Goff. End zone shot. Easy for Josh Reynolds. His old Rams teammate. They're getting it done in Detroit. And the Lions have taken the lead for the first time today. It's here in the first half. Amon Ross and Brown was the target there. Second down goal. That is caught by Gibbs. Touchdown. And a second touchdown pass for quarterback Jared Goff. Goff. Laporta! Touchdown! Fourth and two. Goff to the end zone. Touchdown! Third time to Laporta! He is putting on a show! Five touchdown passes. Second and goal. Goff looking to throw. Goff to the end zone. Touchdown. Amon Ross St. Brown of the Lions. Regain the lead. Ben Johnson, Jared Goff do a phenomenal job converting on the fourth downs when they needed to. And that's uh, surprising. Second down. Good protection. Downfield. Williams got it. Jamison Williams to the 15. Second down and 10. There's St. Brown. Head of steam. Touchdown, Detroit. Wow. Here's the end of it. This play that they're about to run, they, they've known all week. First down at the Minnesota 44. Fake to Gibbs. Goff loads up. Let's it rip. Man open. Perfect throw. Kelly Freeman. Spot him out of bounds inside the five. Fake to Jameer Gibbs. Deep throw from Goff. Down the sideline, Sam Brown. Almond Ross, Sam Brown in a foot race. Eyes on the end zone. Cuts it back. Sam Brown is all the way. Touchdown Detroit. But you want to be 100%. You want to feel 100%. And <laughs> you've just been grinding at it. I don't know what a Caleb Evans is doing. Obviously a blown coverage. You thought you had help over the top. It looked like Andrew Booth got caught in the middle of, of the field. Fourth and a long yard. Two for the touchdown. Goff looking to throw. Throws back the end zone. Laporta! Touchdown Detroit again. They're three for three. Michael Hoyt drops out in coverage more than any other sort of outside linebacker. Third and five. Goff. End zone. Touchdown. Josh Reynolds. The Bucs aren't going to blitz. These guys have to have a day. They have to get some pressure. This will not work if you allow those... Anthony Ferkser out of Harvard. Sixth year man is the second tight end. Goff looking. St. Brown. End zone! Touchdown Detroit! St. Brown! Pressure situations in the last two weeks. And Mike, I have to say, Jared Goff even if you don't score a touchdown and you get stopped, you take the three and still stop the clock. This is the game. Goff pumps, fires end zone. It is caught for the touchdown. What a grab by Williams to keep this game alive. Timeouts, they had the benefit of the two-minute warning and just a really nice basic cross on the back end line. Out of that bunch formation. A nice catch there. You see 